If you guys are looking for a cheap and reliable place to get your coins, check out FIFA Ultimate Team Coins. Their link will be in the description and use the code ETONY to get 5% off. What is going on guys? Welcome back to another player review. We're going to be using a cheaper player tonight because of an incident. So I'll let you guys know in just a second. But if you guys are looking for a cheap place to get PSN cards, Microsoft points, or cheap games, check the link in the description. So I began trying out the second highest rated player in team of the season, to my knowledge, is Tevez. So I thought we did Ibra because he's the highest rated and now we have Tevez. I was trying out Tevez alongside Icardi. But it seemed like Icardi was doing all the work, every single match, scoring the goals, and so on and so forth. So maybe Tevez, I might have to try him out as a center attack in mid, rather than a striker, because I just don't think he performs too well with that high and high work rate. But anyway, let us begin. So Icardi has some pretty impressive stats when you look at his in-game stats. He has 99 finishing, he has 99 jumping, and 99 heading accuracy. And I tried, you know, crossing it to him a couple of times, and I have to say, he is a very dangerous aerial threat. So if you want to try him out as a lone striker, he definitely works in formations where he He's alone up top but I have to say with a striker alongside him he worked even better but another thing is like he has so many 99s in his stats it's crazy because he's not exactly a very high overall card now he has 99 positioning with high attacking and low defensive work rate this guy was so clinical and always in position he reminded me of some of the best finishers from the previous FIFAs and I have to say like if you're looking for a clinical finisher and someone that is just always in position for counter attacks and so on and so forth Icardi is your man and also he is not even slow this time he has 80 87 pace with high agility and high balance and high strength you know exactly what sort of striker you're looking at you're looking at a pretty much a complete forward minus his two star skill moves that is pretty bad two star skill moves is so bad on the striker man like three stars you could just about you know do a couple of them but two stars is gonna limit what sort of skill moves you can do with him but because I'm not exactly a skiller it wasn't really much of a problem for me but I could see if you're a skiller it's gonna be a big problem because some of the stuff that you do at certain angles you will not be able to do them with team of the season Icardi but overall he's a very very special player definitely recommended by me and if you're between Tevez and Icardi to buy as a, as your striker for your Serie A team go ahead and try Icardi he will not disappoint you in my opinion his shooting as well was pretty good I'm not gonna say amazing or um, like you know excellent he just just decent shooting because his long shot stats on the best but he does have that high shot power so he did get me a couple of shots outside the penalty area but nothing too amazing when it comes down to shooting awesome positioning is the big big um, selling point for him 99 heading accuracy and 99 jumping he just has it all except the skill moves. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, I'd really appreciate a like. Make sure you let me know in the comment section below who would you like me to review tomorrow because there's like four team of the seasons impacts right now. So I need your help. Make sure you comment in the